G'day everyone and welcome to Diamond Art Waddell. Today I am doing some unboxings and I have found this one in the vault as you might say in my collection and I believe it's from Diamond Express and I would have ordered this quite a while ago so I'll try and add all those little links and things down below for you guys but I haven't actually even opened the parcel and it's been sitting there for a while now so I think it's well and truly overdue to be opened basically so um, they put like the big fragile stickers on it and that's what makes me know basically it's a Diamond Express package sitting there waiting for me to open Diamond Express are very good as far as um, customer questions and stuff like that so if you have got a query shoot them a message because they are more than happy to answer them for you I've always found them very good in that department so I'm just going to take on this part here hang on a minute so they wrap up your diamond paintings really well and snug in the plastic bags and I will eventually get it open lots and lots of sticky tape fragile stickers so they do look after your parcel on its little journey the best that they can anyway oh struggles real ah got it out of there finally it's free oh what a pretty box so they also come all their diamond paintings come in a box sometimes they're these red ones sometimes there's a green one says diamond express on it but this is obviously angel's hand they've sourced this one from um little like it's a decent sort of cardboard so it's going to take a bit of a beating from the postal journey and let's face it they do go on a bit of a adventure okay so this ends open we'll go with this end so if you just want to have a look at some of the details on the box there they are peel back and works all the sort of stuff you see and just some really nice designs on there so yeah it is a nicely designed box and if you'd like to store your diamond paintings back in the box you can definitely do that so, yep everything's just going to come out in this big burrito so diamond express use the double-sided tape now i know some people don't like it but um i don't really mind it far as at least from here um, i've had very minimal issues with the double-sided tape and when i did have what an issue once which was minute um, they were really really good at um, sorting out the issue for me so yeah if you do find yourself asking a question etc etc go for it and um shoot them a communication because they would be very happy to help you out okay just trying to not pull that canvas around too much being double-sided tape and you get a nice little kit with diamond express i must say some baggies some the little metal tweezers little poor boat type um tray so yeah and of course your little drill pen it's a clear drill pen so they are a pretty basic kit but it's a nice little kit i order round drills but you can get round or square you can choose from your preferred from there as well so we'll just let this jiggle around for a bit and just sort of let it slowly come to good if you take your time with the double-sided tape you'll find you'll have less rivers etc or at least chance of i should say if they're already there they're there but um 
I can feel that's nice and smooth and I don't know what the image is going to be because I was getting just random images it's a 40 by 50 so I didn't really know it was in the box anyway even if I could remember okay just give me a second here I'm just going to so I haven't had a lot of these type um, of canvases for a while so usually I've been getting a lot of pour glue so, and this um, the Diamond Express is like how they put the big logo on the top so you know exactly where your canvas come from that's nice but they do use uh, just the one big sheet which is a little bit daunting for me to peel back although it does sort of kind of make it easier in one sense for um, putting it all straight you have the sections they um, I don't know they don't line up too great sometimes so far so good just peeling back nice and slow like and I'm just trying to bring that back into shot so you can sort of see what is happening I've got a big list of things I want to unbox so many unboxings coming so many unboxings coming onto the channel and a lot from the vault we're going to have some vault unboxings like this one so anything I've had for a while I'm going to do an unboxing and I'm going to attempt to put links as best I can down in the description box gosh that's looking so pretty um, yeah so I'm going to try and do that and because there's some really pretty wow really lovely um, diamond paintings just waiting to be viewed by people so I really want to get some of them out there and show you guys I had no idea this was sitting in my house oh my goodness this is just too nice I have to just turn it a bit to get oh I did not know they had this image even So cool. How far am I from the brinks of it all? Pretty much push it. Wow. That big bang was the heat rejecting my trailer out there. It's just gone. It's gone from the heat. The heat is extraordinary today. I'm inside filming with the air conditioner on. Damn straight I am. This cater's screeching. The metal's flexing. It's all hot. I'm here diamond painting well unboxing diamond paintings I will be doing some diamond painting after this I can, I can sit and just relax but anyway wow 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 look at this this is a beautiful image of this beautiful bird I'm gonna have to go up a little bit to see it better um, 40 by 50 I don't know how many colors it's got. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five. Okay, thirty-five colors. Didn't say I had to count them all down the side there. This will be gorgeous as. All right, let's go up because I want to try and get as much as I can to the one shot of this thing. So that's where the paper is down there. So I'm just going to cab that just on the edge, and that pretty much gives you the full, pretty much gives you the full Monty of it. Maybe go up a bit higher, can I? I hope that's in shot. I can't tell from where I am so I'm just going on sheer luck at this point that is such a pretty image I just love the style of it wow 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 
Okay, so one of the okay pros and cons. We'll just sort of start with that. Pro, love the image, love the color. Um, really, really strong definition of colors, and, and and looks really nice saturation in your canvas. Um, it's very, very nice. The fact that I know there is what 35 colors, I believe, in this will definitely bring the image across. Really lovely. And yeah, and it looks like we'll have a bit closer look at these details now. It's a really nice saturation of color in the canvas. It's got everything going on there. Really nice print. The symbols are very clear, although they do have little round circle doodads on the round drill um, canvases. So I'm not a big fan of them. I just sort of wish they weren't there. <laughs> but other than that I can't really f that's just a personal preference really that that's all that is obviously if you're doing squares you won't have that problem but the print quality is really nice and you can see your chart on the left hand side there as I'm just sort of moving through pretty good far as symbols and what they are DMC numbers I believe on the side there even though they don't state and there's your thumbnail in the corner there beautiful sparkly canvas some nice glitter on the canvas and he's just a beautiful bird isn't he the little um, Robin or something maybe I'm not sure I'm not good with birds I'm sorry but he's pretty nonetheless and top left and top right is your charts you can see that beautiful glitter going through the canvas really nice and it's a nice softish canvas it's not too stiff in its flexibilities I suppose yeah and 40 by 50 so it's a nice big I believe print size with these guys too um, it's a the actual print from memory creaky but yeah he's lovely isn't he So yeah, there you go. Quick run through of this beautiful canvas. I will just gently fold this one back. And I can't really see any real issues with the tape, the double sided tape at this stage. You use slight little lines, but that's not going to affect um, drilling at all. Well, really shouldn't anyway gently just smoothing this back down let it just do its thing it's making sure I don't have any air bubbles and issues in there and these canvases flatten out really nicely and they are nice to work on I've done a few up and they are good to work on that's for sure I'm very I find them very nice to work on anyway even you know if you're not a fan of the double side tape they're quite good beautiful all right that's pretty darn good now for the time being I will probably just get my little handy dandy, you know those little plastic, look like pizza cutters on the side I think, you know, and give it a bit of a push down with that before I store it, just to be on the safe side. Okay, so I'm going to have a look at the drills with this lot, if my thing will just not do weird stuff sometimes. When I try to focus, for some reason it does like this really close up 
and yeah I can't tell if it's doing that on the recording but apparently it doesn't so here are my drills really nice thick plastic good quality um, packaging in that regards so you know you know your drills are going to stay together I've got all these little loose dudes ah they're falling out everywhere at me get back over there so much in here lots and lots and lots of colors we'll see how we go at looking at all these drills so we have an inventory sheet which is one of the nice things about um, Diamond Express they always put one of these in their kits and you can see all your symbols and ID quantities and bags so all your colors have got their code printed out this is very dark a bit hard to read but as long as it's all right over there on the canvas it doesn't look as dark on the canvas but that is the image yeah, a picture of the image basically very cute and some basic instructions are on there so yeah, you get all that plus all your drills and there is a lot of drills okay um, as you can see I'm just going to put them aside I will probably do a check off later 939 but we'll just have a I'll show you just real quickly some of the drills if I can as far as quality so you've got these are your 939s you can see a lot of those we won't go into too much detail with these guys uh, so yeah little numbers on these little bags to tell you what drill they match up to and that's what you use to match a symbol nice red color I hope I can get it uh, anyway uh, the other ones I've worked up I've had the same drill packets and the drills are very nice anyway once they're on the canvas so I was quite happy to purchase them from them again I've purchased from them many a time so and all the kits of either the ones I've worked up or the ones I've got have looked pretty good as I said I've had that um, one issue was a little bit average canvas and she was happy to correct my problem so I don't mind look things happen in the world out of all the ones I've got that's all I've had you know so you can see lots of greens more shades of those grey colour greens um, we have some purple some pinky colours as well yeah lots of grey tones really nice hot pinks and greens so I like how this this green and pink colors look nice together lots of lots, lots of little loose baggies I'll just sort of show you just very quickly before looking at it properly like going through it all lots of pretty colors and lots of little loose drill bags but yeah so yeah this is a lot going on <laughs> there's a lot going on with these kits um, yeah lots and lots of little bags I wish sometimes these would just have the one big bag that would be so much easier but anyway and some places do do that but this one has all the little ones big little ribbons of them 
but once you kit up they all go into one container anyway so yeah sorts out that problem um yeah so that's a really cute little kit of this bird here from diamond express i am so glad i pulled that out of the vault and showed you guys one of the ones i purchased quite a long time ago i haven't even looked at amazingly i usually just look at them and check them a bit but um yeah this one has slipped through the gaps and yeah i've got a quite a few other pieces i will bring to your attention and show you because you might really enjoy looking at them and find a real little gem just like this one beautiful yeah, I'm going to just leave that alone. Stop. Stop it, Dale. Just stop it. That's it. We're done. <laughs> leave it alone. So all in all, you have a nice um, nice kit from Diamond Express. They're nice size canvas, etc. So yeah, I will add um, as much information as possible in the description box down below. So yeah, if you want to search around in there, uh, I'll link Diamond Express this website try and find this image if I can and um, there's a lot of other really cool stuff down there too so go check all that out until next time uh, next video I'll say farewell and be safe and be your life beautiful with diamond art this is Dale signing out have a wonderful day and yeah thank you everyone for stopping by and watching my video and please consider subscribing if you're new to the channel and welcome back to everybody and hit the bell for notifications. I'll see you in the next video guys.